County Executive Jan Gardner announced Frederick County has been awarded a $202,012 grant from the State of Maryland Rural Broadband Office, which will be used to expand broadband capabilities into a portion of the Rocky Ridge community. The pilot program is part of a larger strategic plan being developed to ensure more residents can connect to fast and reliable internet service. The service is necessary for many job applications, teleworking, online education, shopping, and staying connected to family and friends. Affordable high-speed internet is an essential part of our economic development efforts, so people can work wherever they live. Throughout the COVID-19 pandemic, it became clear just how much we rely on the internet. The grant Frederick County received is to support the expansion of broadband into rural areas in coordination with the private internet service provider. Comcast, which maintains an extensive network in more densely populated areas of the county, agreed to partner on the pilot project. Details of the project will be determined in the coming weeks, including the route of the network. An Australian-based company that develops diagnostic solutions for infectious diseases announced plans to open a new manufacturing facility in Frederick County. The facility, Illum, will provide tests for infectious diseases, including at-home rapid tests for COVID-19 to support ongoing U.S. pandemic preparation and response. The company will invest $16 million into Frederick County, occupying 180,000 square feet of space in Executive Court South and the Progress Labs Corporate Park. The project is expected to create about 1,500 new jobs by the end of 2022. Frederick County's COVID-19 vaccination clinic offers regular operating hours at its Oak Street location, which should be accessed from Himes Avenue. Anyone needing a first dose of vaccine can schedule an appointment or simply walk into the clinic Wednesdays and Thursdays from 4 to 7 p.m and Fridays and Saturdays from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. The Maryland Department of Health strongly supports use of the Pfizer vaccine in adolescents 12 to 17 years of age and encourages anyone in this age range to get vaccinated immediately. Scheduling an appointment in advance speeds up the on-site registration process. To schedule a vaccine, visit frederickcountymd.gov slash COVID vaccine or call 301-600-7900. Spanish speakers can call 301-600-7905. Frederick County's farmers are creating value-added products to carry the agricultural industry into the future. To support their efforts, Frederick County Executive Jan Gardner announced 306,000 and agriculture innovation grants to 14 farming operations. The economies and the success of our small towns and our rural villages really are tightly linked and depend on our th having a thriving agricultural industry. So that's why keeping agriculture economically viable is a priority. The grants were the first in the new competitive grant program, which will be offered twice a year. The projects selected for funding are anticipated to create 11 full-time and 17 part-time positions. More than 30 applications were received for the Agriculture Innovation Grant Program. Grants are awarded for $5,000 or more to help farmers expand or diversify their business operations to remain profitable and viable.